Today it's just um, harvesting for the summer squash, but also the peppers that we have growing out here. So we are at the Aligned uh, Solar Farm at Iowa State University, where we have an agrivoltaic project. So it's combining solar farm with agriculture. So a place where uh, dual existence of uh, energy production and crop production, that's what we mean by agrivoltaics. So this is a very uh, a new and innovative project which we have here at Iowa State University where uh, we are trying to uh, uh, e evaluate the feasibility of growing specialty crops within a solar farm. So between the panels, underneath the panels, there is space where we can grow crops. Our original thesis is it would be more efficient to grow uh, these crops under the growing panels, the solar panels. Um, and that way it can kind of do a dual system with uh, harvestable crops for people to eat, but then also energy for fueling people's homes and powering people's homes. First thing which we have demonstrated, and this is the first year of the project, is that crops can be grown under the panels, between the panels, in a commercial way, using commercial techniques. I think the harvest has relatively been close to the same. We are finding that the crops are doing perfectly well as they do outside. There is some, there's definitely more shade in there given the time of the uh, day. The hope is that with these rotating um, solar panels, it's able to kind of block out the direct radiation and the amount of heat that will be causing stress on the plant. We want the agriculture land stays in agriculture, but at the same time, it's dual use. You know, a farmer could still uh, 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 generate some extra income using those panels as energy, but the land is still protected in terms of growing crops. What are the things that we need to discuss uh, so that uh, agrivoltaic can exist here in the state? What are the constraints? What are the challenges? And what are the opportunities?